everyone, I am Stuti Parekh. Today in this video, I will explain in detail different elements of interior design. So let's start with what all elements are included uh, in an interior designing process. Uh, following are the main elements of interior design, form, space, line, texture, pattern and color. Starting with the first element which is form. The shape of an object is a form such as square, rectangle, round, oval, etc. Form in a room should be harmonious. Rectangular shapes are more pleasing than the square shapes. Rectangles are more often the dominant shape in a room. Squares suggest a rational, stable form with no direction. Circle implies unity and completeness, whereas triangle is a stable but a dynamic form. Now we shall see some of the images that implies the element of form. Basically, space is the area in which we work. It defines the limits and set boundaries of our design. Space is limited by length, width and height. To make a space seem larger, use soft or light or cool colors. To make a space uh, seem small, use patterns or dark warm colors. Now we shall see some images that implies the element of space. Basically, line establishes shape and form. It suggests movement and leads or moves the eye around the room. Lines are either straight or curved. Vertical lines suggest formality and dignity. Diagonal lines create a sense of drama. Horizontal lines are relaxed, restful and casual. Curved lines add interest and relief, whereas curved lines are also softer. Now we shall see some of the images that implies the element of lines. of texture. The surface of an object, its smoothness or its roughness is another important decorating tool. Use of several complementary textures can add variety and keep interest alive. Be careful to avoid dramatic contrast between the textures. Heavily textured rough surfaces absorb more light. Smooth and shiny surfaces uh, are more formal and reflect more light. Now we shall see some of the images that uh, implies the element of texture. It is a repetition of a decorative motif on a surface. 
It is related to texture, but individual elements of pattern appear as individual items and texture appears as an overall tone. Pattern provides a spice in decorating. Scale is important in the use of pattern. If large print is used on a smaller object, the pattern will get lost. Uh, you can safely use a floral pattern with a geometrical pattern, uh, a stripe or a check. Uh, be careful not to create an effect that is uh, too busy. Use patterns that are in proportion to each other. Now we shall see some images that implies the element of pattern. That's all for now.